our dramatic music intensifies. Da -da -da -da. Hello once again YouTube and welcome to a collector's review of, drumroll please, whoa, it's the Warthog Run. This is Simon and Jonathan from the SS Motion, the, the gods of Mega Bloks, and honestly, in our opinion, the, the collective largest collection of Halo Mega Bloks probably on the planet. And we're here today to do a very non-biased review of Halo Mega Bloks. Gone are the days where we wanted paid sponsorship from Mega Bloks. Gone are the days where we got free stuff. You got free stuff. So here we are. We're going to be honest. We love it. We hate it. We're going to dive straight in. The box art. Whoa, it's way too zoomed in. Professionalism, boys. Here we are, the Warthog Run Halo Mega Blocks Edition. Back to the Halo 3 Chief. Yeah. Uh, so you can see his battle damage there. I mean, it's the favorite look. It's the it Mark is. 6. It is the favorite look, um, yeah. Even, you know, Halo Infinite's going back to yeah, it. Yeah, so. uh, even 343 here now starting to realize that we don't want things changed. This just looks incredible. I mean, I love the gold design. Yeah. Um, I, I've been off the radar from Mega Bloks for a little bit when I saw this uh, anniversary stuff. Oh, my oh my, I need to get some of that myself. Self. Looking pretty good. Arbiter's there looking a bit sketchy. The Hunter's uh, chill and he's like, I'm just gonna aim at the floor over the bird to the side. I'm not yeah. even gonna aim at him. That does look spot on. Oh, you're falling for the trap. Oh, That's Hunter's a Halo, a Halo 4, 4 Hunter. Hunter. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Also happy that the sets now come with a piece separator. I swear I would have saved half of my teeth if I'd had this back in the day. With this little bookmark so you can see what page of the t instructions you're on. It's, it's pretty cool. So immediately you're thinking, golly gosh, that set looks beautiful. And I would agree with you. Uh, we're gonna break down what definitely doesn't work about this set but let's talk about what does work first this hunter is probably like we've said maybe the nicest figure that they've ever released yeah mega I mean, blocks has ever released this figure alone was the reason why i've just bought four of this set like it, you bought four amazing. yeah i'm wow. a bit mad but you know i saw that hunter on the box and i'm like yeah i want a piece of that i mean that it's just gorgeous like every single thing about this set stop focusing on the background so everything about this hunter is just gorgeous uh they've completely redesigned the entire thing get with the times all the cool kids like this super articulations these translucent gems here um the pieces on the back look way lo less like they'll just get lost in my mega block supply these shields really on point uh they got a tiny bit of scratching battle damage there really appreciate that jeez that is like i mean that's like that spot on that is literally like that meme it's like who are you i'm you but better it's absolutely it awful is. like even the the pure green gems there and they are th this this looks like this looks like it's made of worms all right moving on we've got the arbiter and the chief they're uh, straight from halo 3 and good golly uh, there was some heavy breathing in the room when jonathan brought these around they're gorgeous on the camera right now, I'm noticing one thing, Jonathan. That that helmet is a different color. Yeah, so you seeing that now? Like, I yeah, I can really see before. it. Yeah, uh, that's because it's soft plastic. Mm. Uh, the rest of the armor is hard plastic, and Mega are really struggling to get the colors to match. You see this on the Halo Three Marine that they've just put out. Um, basically, any of these metallic green figures are currently really struggling. Mm. Um, I think Mega should probably have QC tested these a bit better. Because uh, it does look terrible in, under certain lighting conditions. Those shoulders. Oh, I think I actually do prefer this version of it. I think the gold is just right. Oh, yeah. and it just kind of makes the art to figure pop. It, it really does. On the SS Motion, when we used to do reviews, we were pretty kind to Mega Bloks. But uh, one of the main things we always said was that they f they were foolish for not releasing sets that were specific to missions in game or levels in game, like Snowbound, High Ground are some yeah. of the best sets they've ever made. So really nice to see that they've made a set, you know, specific to a mission. So well, I don't know there's what no part of the mission this is. Mission. There is absolutely Wait, no what? hunters in the mission. It's a foreigner no, and no, mission. No, 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 yeah. no. Yeah. No, in there Halo are, 3? There's never no hunters way. No, there in are, a Warthog there, run. Hey, there are hunters no. in the Warthog Run. No, there's not. I am going to <laughs> interlace footage of hunters in the Warthog Run. I'm telling you, there are absolutely what, yo, because they. I will eat no. a hunter if you find that. <laughs> no way, dude. No way. Warren, right into the hangar. You know what? Moving on! <laughs> but boy howdy, come on, focus. Boy howdy, this looks like a good warthog, but also looks like a fucking bumper car. They decided to widen the model uh, by an extra two studs, and it just really stands out. The it's suspension. absolutely ridiculous. They gave it suspension, which is great, but they've raised it so much. I mean, compare a figure to it. Yeah. Like, the guy has to get a ladder to get in. They've gone too far. Mega Constructs. You've gone too far. He may be injected with all those super soldier serums, but he ain't getting up there. It also shocked me that there's been no green warthog produced by Mega Bloks since what was it, 2012? 2012. Yeah. The Halo 4. And here it is, out of the way, newbie. 
Look at that. Look at those wheels. That makes sense. That's actually really jarring when you look at it. But let's talk about some good things. Yeah. Let's talk about because there are some good things. Um, this battle damage is awesome. The turret's really good, but uh, have they made any improvements on that? No, exactly the same exactly. build. Exactly. It doesn't have this drop down piece at the back no. like the old Warthog does. These lights are much more like actual lights instead of just basic studs. They're like gems. But they That's are the wrong good. shape. They are. Yeah. If you look at any Halo Warthog in game. These are like rectangular or square. Mega constructs, mega blocks, whatever you want to call them. They got this right on previous Warthogs. Mm -hmm. Why have you gone backwards? I know a lot of people on the farms are like, oh yeah, Warthog suspension, but no, why? You don't mm. need it. And it raises the Warthog so much, it looks stupid. So you got weapon clips on the side here. Apparently there is no peg to attach the carbine into the back of the torso. Nothing. Nothing. This, oh, this? oh, disgusting. Look at that. For that and that alone, we give this set a 1 out of 10. Apparently all the sets come with gold things now, all the anniversary ones. Now with nozzles. Let's do as the, the, the S-Motion used to do. Jonathan, what would you rate the quality of this set? Ready? 3, 2, 1, 7. Eight. Value for money. Ready? 3, well how much did it cost? <laughs> uh, $30 I believe. $30. Yeah. 3, 2, 1, 7. Nine. Innovation. Ready? <laughs> <laughs> Three, two, one, four. Six. Um, yeah, four. You know what? I might change my vote. Ready? Three, two, one, four. four. Mother, shout me for dinner during a Mega Bloks review. And you know what, Jonathan? More than anything else, happy to be back doing you know some Halo Mega Bloks reviews. Um, it's After three years, uh, man. Three <laughs> years, yeah. I mean, for me, even longer. You, you kept the channel going with Mega Bloks reviews a bit while after me. Uh, so really nice to be back in, back in the groove. Also check out my new disco channel, The Traveling Dukes. And as always, have, have a lovely day. We used to sign off with, should we, what should we sign off with? Oh yeah, here's, a, here's, here's an old chief to do a comparison. How far they have come. Uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, subscribe and Bloxfest 2020, probably not. Uh, series 1 pack, signing off. Sorry, do a Megaplex review. <laughs>